Yeah, this is Oscar. Um, Try to get a walk around the house every day with my daughter. I got a 15 month old daughter. But I also like to go across the street. Okay, I'm going for a morning walk with my daughter. It's Sunday morning. I'm just gonna go over and walk around the area of the nearby high school. Over by the tennis courts, there's a creek, a little waterfall. We're looking at the water tributary. Trying to do a little bit of walking. And there's our little morning hike through the wilderness for a little bit of uh, exercise and a little outside perspective on the world. Starting to get pretty nippy out. A tributary right there comes down, drops down through this little culvert, and then across. A lot of cedar trees, uh, sword ferns, a um, swimming pool, miscellaneous everything. All right, we're at the pool, South Kitsap Pool. That's basically open. the high school uh, meet. Anyway, I try to go for a walk every morning. Every day, if not every morning. Because it helps to open things up and get a different perspective. Being inside is fine in confinement, but it's always nice to be able to get a broader view of things. Get a broader view. And you realize, uh, uh, like my family members, my wife or my daughter, that we uh, things come up from a different perspective, a broader perspective, like uh, relative to distance, things relative to distance, a little higher perspectives on what you're doing. For me, it's really important to be able to focus on focus focus on what the, the things of the day, list off uh, five or six mandatory things to do. It just basically oxygenates and gets your uh, body going, it makes my thinking clearer. Okay, we're over in the gravel field next to the school. All right, that's the kind of fun we have when we're kids. We believe we found a stone. Here's a stone. Thank you. That's enough. Enough theatrics of chasing the camera. Sometimes I feel it's required to take a walk every day. I do. Uh, sometimes I don't do much of it, and I, I notice that what happens is uh, I start to suffer from the lack of uh, mobility and the lack of uh, oxygenation and the lack of higher, broader thinking. You get out in the woods or out in nearby territory, you, get, you talk to different people, then you get a chance to open up and get going. So it's a very helpful. Walking is very helpful in many aspects. I see that happening. It releases a lot of initial tension and stress. Gets things started off pretty well. Looking at these birds here, we get a bunch of crows coming through here. They come through in groups and families. 